Welcome to Brick Trains, and I'm Joey, and we have number two in the series of these craft promotional items. Uh, again, if, uh, check out the previous video, there will be a link right there um, for number one. You can send in $2 and the promotional coupon on the back of this box, and they would send you one of three sets. And you got to check off which set you wanted, right? And send in your $2. I think it was just $2. Yeah, no no shipping, just $2. I guess the shipping was the $2 or the $2 was the shipping. Any anyway, rate, shipping was cheaper back then, I guess. So there were, again, like I said, there were three of these. This is number two. The first one was a tow truck, Jeep, an antique car. And you can check out that video. And this one is a house trailer, car, and camper. So let's get into that. These would have been shipped to you in a brown, just a plain brown box. Um, I, I showed one in the first one. I don't have the brown box that these would have came in, that this set particularly would have came in. I do have the instructions, which uh, is uh, pretty, <laughs> Pretty simple, right? We're talking about we're talking about really five panels here. One panel for the car, two panels for the camper, and then uh, well, actually, wait a minute, the house trailer. Sorry, the house trailer. So one panel for the car, two panels for the house trailer, and then the camper van. It had two panels on the back side. So these are pretty. Pretty simple builds. Uh, again, this would have been the model maker mini wheel uh, subset from Samsonite, um, or theme from Samsonite. Uh, so they all all came with these little mini wheels. None of these have any of the dually wheels. These are all single wheels on the axle. Um, all, so this would have came out in 71. So these would have all been pretty much been ABS bricks or like modern day plastic, but they could have had some sam uh, could have had some CA in them. I think most of these that I have here are all ABS. Um, but you can, as you can see, so here's the car. We'll get the car. The grill is wore off. Um, this one, it's got a grill too. As you can see, these, are, these have been well played with, uh, well loved, as I like to say. Um, got the you know I got these on a, on a lot off of eBay more than likely um, these white roof pieces those are two by four so they had those were pretty new um, as far as the piece count and stuff goes I think these were 74 piece sets I believe this one was uh, again like I said 1971 pat pending bricks this has got the ball and hitch kind of connection which this one's cracked as you can see right there it's kind of cracked but these are these are they all kind of cracked real easy this was it's pretty cool but after 40 something years 45 48 something years the uh so 71 to 250 something years yeah um you know the plastic is going to break down even the even the good abs plastic so trying to get that stuck back on there a little better so now these we've we've been having this conversation for me and a couple people for several of these videos on how and why did lego or samsonite count the pieces because in this time wow i just tore that one completely up that wheel there has been melted so <laughs> um to kind of go over the, the reason these piece counts were are kind of off from like where brick set or brick set or brick link uh, may indicate the black brick or the wheel holder that that's considered one piece. This axle with the wheel hubs would be considered one piece. This one's terrible because I just pulled that rubber wheel off. And then you had your two wheels. Uh, never fear, I have plenty of these extra wheels I will be able to put this back together so I guess the real question is, is did these come in the set 
separated like that or did they uh, get that one tire back on there it's kind of funny the one tire is in really good shape but the other one is just completely corroded so did they come that way or did they come assembled I don't know I don't remember I was only two so <laughs> um, we need to find a, a couple of these sets sealed and open them up and see what these mini wheels how they came if they really came assembled or not and and then the uh, this block eventually was changed and the assembly was all together these are these are the open ones on the bottom eventually they came where they were looped over and you couldn't even um you couldn't even take the wheel axles out you could tell still take the tires off but you couldn't take the axle out so got a flat tire got a boom tire there so yeah this is number two uh again if you want to know more about the velveta promotion uh, watch the first video i go over the box a little bit uh, there were a couple different promotions from craft and velveta over these uh, this was number two this is not set number two this is not even samsonite set number two this is just promotion number two off of this box but that's how the set got numbered so um if you go to look this up i believe this is going to be like 2-10 on brick set possibly brick link as well not many of these around anymore they're kind of hard to find i don't even have a box for this one the box uh, will is a brown well it's a brown box like this um, this one here is for number this is for number three it's got that mm51 number three on it the um my assumption is I have a I have a box that has MM51 number one, which had the other set in it, the number one off of this, and I have the number three, which is the number three set. I don't have a number two, but my assumption is that they all came, or that's how they were indicated uh, on these boxes. So these were a shipping box from from Samsonite. The, you know, uh, Samsonite made or yeah, Samsonite made all these sets, sent them to Kraft because these are coming out of Chicago when the Samsonite's uh, facilities was in Loveland, Colorado. So my, my assumption is, is that Lego Samsonite made all these kits, sent them to Kraft, and then Kraft uh, distributed these sets uh, over the time. Uh, this come out in 71, but I've seen postmarks. This one has no postmark on it. Uh, but I've seen postmarks as late as like 73, 74 time frame. My guess is that Leg or Kraft had a lot of these in stock in their stock, and after Lego took back the license from Samsonite in the United States, Kraft was still selling these. So, <laughs> um, and and that would be why you probably can. And like I said, I've seen I've seen some of these Kraft boxes that have got labels or time stamps that or date, postage stamps, excuse me, postage marks that are should be way later than than they should be but they still exist so all right that's this little model maker mini wheel set number two craft promotional 1971 um they're pretty hard to get parts are not that hard or parts are not that hard if you want to piece one together go to brooklyn get the inventory piece it together um if you want it the the vintage pieces excuse me some of these vintage pieces are getting a little more a little tougher to get they're a little tougher to get in good condition so turn around hide the bad wheel so all right that's the number two so thanks for watching so it's the end of the line must be comment contest time so four by four plates i said well i stumbled all over it but uh, what when did four by four plates come out how close was it to the when those sets come out. First correct answer in the comments. We'll pin you to the